question two then from the 2016 advanced time maths. Here we go. Geometric sequence. Last year it was an arithmetic one. Part A for three marks out of the six. Calculate the value of the common ratio. Well, the second term in a geometric sequence is given by the first term multiplied by the ratio. You just keep multiplying by the ratio each time and that comes to 108. The, by the time you get to the fifth term, you'll have multiplied by that ratio four times and that'll take you to four. A pair of simultaneous equations. Two equations and two variables. Divide them. If you do two divided by one, that'll knock out a. I'll just show it anyway. a r to the four over a r will be 4 over 108. So that drops down to r cubed equals, and there's not a lot happens with that. That would just go down to 1 over 27, which is very handy for a cube, so that r equals a third. Now part B, state why the associated geometric series, associated, that's when you put the B pluses in between them, has a sum to infinity for one mark. Well, what could you say? The sum to infinity exists as that common ratio is a proper fraction, as the absolute value of a third is less than one. Is that sufficient? Or would you have to mention that that's R as well, as R is less than one? Not really sure how they'd want that marked if you should put as the absolute value of the common ratio is less than 1, and then just specify it as a third. Don't know, just to cover yourself. And part C, find the value of this sum to infinity for two marks. It doesn't give you that in the answers at the front, so I presume you're meant to know that one yourself and not derive it, presumably from that. I'm just going to leap in with it. The sum to infinity will be A over 1 minus R simply because that r to the n, when it's a fraction, a fraction to a power will disappear as that power becomes high. But I don't know a, so I'll have to pop that r equals a third back into one of these, I'll put it into one, which says one third of a equals 108, so a equals three times that, 324. Putting it to this formula, 324 over one minus a third, 324 over 2 thirds. 3 times the top there would be 972, halving that 486. The sum to infinity is 486.